Middle of the week, and here we go. A little different news today, a little different market environment today than what we've seen in the past few days. Dow futures up 100 points this morning. That's right, 100 points higher. S&P up 12.5. NASDAQ futures this morning up 54 and a quarter. Well, why is that? Well, Chairman Powell comes out and says that cross currents are weighing in on the economy, uh, signifying a possible rate cut. He's hinting at the rate cut possibility. That's got the markets higher. So again, we'll see what that means as we get started on this Wednesday. Uh, Levi is here on the left. Initial move is down. I like Levi because it's down 9%. I could do 55 now since it moved up. Posting Levi. Levi spiked down, which isn't good. Because a spike down like that could easily... Okay, I'm short. Came down nicely under the lows. But still is. The recent one-minute candle you're seeing here is a spike down. That is, of course, more dangerous. MYL bounced up again, which is good. It's not a big mover. We could short it under 1885 MYL. I'm posting it. I'll take this trade with you here on MYL, traders. MYL is on the trigger point. Triggered, I'm short. We have to survive this pullback in Levi. It's not a big mover, MYL, traders. It's looking for 20 cents. At 65, it's another 7 cents or so. Levi is back to the lows, good. Getting ready for a partial there. Just moved under the lows. Trying to see if it can get under 20. I think it does. It's ready for any sign of a pullback to take a partial. Any sign of a pullback, like if it moves over 23, like if it moves over 21 now. Any sign of pullback. Levi is going. Levi is going. Very nice. Come down on, to 21. Yes. Come, on. Come, on. Come on. Come on. And now, took my partial at 17. So far, market's pushing up. Nasdaq already up in 0.9. I think it touched the 1%. Move and S&P is up 0.54 right now. We are trending higher. Here comes a new low in MYL. Touching my target, almost touching my target now. Need another two, three cents for my target. 65 is my target. It's at 67 now. Almost there, almost there. As I'm buying some ZM now, here, 90 to 75, small size. I'm just watching the spreads and I'm seeing some pressure for the upside and I think it's going to go soon over 93. Now 93 is a whole number and I think we're going to go through. And then we have to deal with the highs, which is 93.27. Now so far the market's more, yes, we did. Now I was assuming that uh, we're going to go through the highs very soon. I want to see the buyers moving up a bit. Watch the buyers and the sellers. Watch the beat, currently at 93.03. Sellers at 15. Who's going to come first? Now you see the sellers just moved to 20. That's a good sign. Now let's see what the buyers are doing. So follow the buyers and the sellers. I don't see this, the buyers moving up so far. Now they're buying at the ask, which is a good sign. If you watch level 2, now the buyers just moved up to 08. They keep buying uh, the 20s. It's a good sign. It should go. Oh, thank you, MYL, at my target and more. Any sign of a pullback now? Took my partial at 60, a little bit better than I expected in MYL. ZM, come on, ZM, it was at the highs. I think we're going to see new high now in ZM. Started with a small size because it's a bit spready. Didn't want to take the risk. Here we go, we're over the highs now. Here comes ZM, very, very close to my target. What's the big seller at uh, 45? You probably want to get your partial before that. It's at a good price right now, 35. But I'm trying to see if it moves over 45 just in case. No, I'm taking 40 now. It took 40. I can't see how it can move over 45. Big sellers there. 400 shares in Levi. And there's no way I'm going to have a loser. So I'm going to add very small size, under 21. It's going to come down under. Looks like it may now. Watch it. So you, you add very small size. Therefore, if you had um, a green trade, you don't want to turn it into a red trade. 
one of the biggest mistakes traders do is uh, adding high quantity to an already green trade. Okay, added now, very small size. Loss was 96 and I was expecting to see it under the loss. That's why I shorted it under the whole number. So again, small size, in case it goes wrong, we're going to have a relatively small stop loss, 20 cents over 21. Now, took my partial in Levi. It was a beautiful trade. Here's the Levi trade traders. Uh, we initially shorted it, can't remember when, <laughs> uh, 21.55. 21.55 that was here. Moved all the way down to 21. Look at this whole number breakdown here. Of course, the lows was a bit lower. So once moving under the whole number, I assumed it's going to come down under the lows, and it did. And then I was only looking for 20 cents and having a 20 cents stop loss. And again, that's an added quantity to an already profitable trade. You get a trade like that, you don't take any um, chances. I mean, you've got a green trade to start with. You don't risk this green trade with large quantity. I did it with quarter size. So if I would have got... Um, hit by this 20 cents move up, that would have reduced like $200 of my profits. That's it. Well, I only have uh, green trades today, Scott. Five green trades. How about you? That's awesome. I've got four green trades today and not uh, not one red trade. So all well. Great. Nice day. Three days in a row for myself. I know, Mayor, you had just a small red day yesterday, but uh, another great week started here midweek already Wednesday. No, actually, Terrific small green trading. day yesterday and a small red day on Sunday, on Monday. So, there you go. Um, yep. Yeah, so I was a bit red on Monday, very small, like $400 finished up yesterday, $600 up. Uh, but today I'm doing good. Um, here's how my account looks like, traders. I've got um, Levi with $1,300, almost $1,400. Share, uh, dollars. These, these were two trades. MU. MYL, ZM, and I'm up $3,300 with um, five trades, two in Levi. So all green, $3,300 after two kind of flat days, one up, one down, very close to zero. I'm very happy. And I think we earned this, Scott. Here comes the money. Here we go. Money talks. Here comes the money. Okay, guys, I don't think I'm going to take another trade. I'm going to cut it here. I will see you all tomorrow. Enjoy the rest of your day. See you. Bye.